Did you look everywhere and didn't find any good 3D object for your project? Look no further than PowerPoint. What? PowerPoint? Yep, PowerPoint. Today we're going to learn how to import 3D object from PowerPoint to Unity. So I got this other tutorial I'm working on right now and I downloaded an asset to help with the environment. But the gun I'm using is just a few blocks put together and I didn't find any cool gun to use. But then I remembered you can add 3D objects to a PowerPoint presentation. So I opened a PowerPoint presentation, insert 3D and looked for a gun. And I found this cool banana gun. But I added another gun to help me show another important thing in this tutorial. But we have a problem. You can save 3D objects like you save an image in PowerPoint by right clicking and save as. But if we change the file extension from PowerPoint to .zip and extract it, we will see that PowerPoint is basically a zip file connected with XML. In the extracted folder, go to PTT Media folder and you will find the 3D object as JLB files. We can't import .glb files to Unity, but we convert it to OBJ online. Don't forget to use the Asset Extractor tab to get the texture for the files. Make sure to convert to OBJ, load the object and convert. You will get the zip file with an OBJ and all the textures you need. Let's do the same thing for the other gun too. While importing to Unity, we have two things that might happen to us. The simple way, we just drag the OBJ into our scene, create new material, apply the texture normal map and the metallic map to the material and apply it to the object. Obviously, you don't have to apply all the textures and you can play with the settings as you wish. For me, it worked better without the metallic map. But it's not always gonna be this easy. We might have an object that is too big for our project. To fix this properly, we will go to the OBJ's scale factor and by trial and error make the object fit our project. We will create a material as before and apply it to the object. If you wanna see the banana gun in the other tutorial, make sure to follow and enable notifications. Thanks for watching! Bye!